top AIG executive has quit after a cut in salary that governments pays are recently restricted executive salaries for firms holding bailout money. Anastasia Kelly resigned yesterday. Kelly was AIG's vice chairman for legal, human resources, corporate affairs, and corporate communications. Kelly's resignation comes after Kenneth Feinberg put pay limits for AIG's top executives. Kelly joined AIG in September 2006 as general counsel. She was in charge of global affairs at the time. Earlier this year, she was promoted to her current position. This month, a pay limit was set for AIG and three other firms at $500,000 for the 26th through 100th highest paid employees. AIG's chief compliance and regulator officer has also left to seek other opportunities. AIG is working on picking successors for both posts and expects a smooth transition. Shares of AIG are rising in early day trading. The stock has been in a narrow range for more than a month.